She lived in a two-room shack on the edge of town by the railroad track. Went to work for my mama when they were both about 16. Her name was Dixie and it fit her right. She and mama were a lot alike. But one was black and the other white. And that's the way it was back then. Mama passed in 63. Dixie worked for Mama and took care of me. And in my eyes, she was family, because you know kids are colorblind. And Jesus said we were all alike. And Daddy said, yes, child, but not quite. And while I tried to figure who was right, Dixie loved me like one of her own. And the only love I knew that knew no bounds is living in a heart that's going under six feet of Mississippi ground. She came to church when I was with 92 and almost dead all dressed up in her Sunday best cause she didn't have long to go and I remember the night she died the angels sang and mama cried and Dixie crossed to the other side when Jesus called her home and now the only love I knew that knew no color and they all the love I knew that knew no bounds is living in a heart that's going under six feet of Mississippi ground. Now when I get troubled, I start feeling down. I can hear old Dixie's voice saying, baby, come here and sit down. And I wonder if a love like that can still be found. Lord, I pray you'll keep that love so pure and sweet that I know lives deep in the heart of Dixie.